my first. You know, I think people really like how you're dropping knowledge bombs. You like those knowledge bombs? Yeah, look, 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 look. Why don't you talk about um, the, the Hong Kong's not part of China thing? I thought that was amazing. That, no, it has to come up and talk. I can't just go into a lecture straight away. Hey, did you know that Hong Kong is not actually part of China? You just brought the topic. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I actually want to know. Explain it to me. Why? It's so, okay, so... Wait, but they're still the same. It's not like... Um, no, it's not like, like the Vatican City. During, it's still part of China. During, so, during, isn't during, it the capital of China? During the Opium Wars, right? China got I didn't their, know anything about the Opium Wars. China got their butt kicked. Because they were on opium? Probably that, but also because the British Empire was huge. Okay. Right. And Wait, so, who was in the who was in the Opium Wars? Was who was there? Was it? China? There was Britain? There was you know British India at the time. Yeah. Yeah. I think those were the two main players. Though. What would you say? Would you say Britain was like Protoss and China was like Zel? Is um, China was Zerg. Zerg? China was so. Zerg. I was thinking that. Yeah, I was exactly. thinking that. That's exactly if you could pick, oh, this sounds racist. But if you could pick a race to be a race in in a race to be a race in uh, StarCraft. Okay. So yeah, I'd say China would be like Zerglings. Yep. Or like Zerg. Totally. Just, yeah. just reproduce and send waves. Russia would be Rush. like Protoss, right? Who would be Terran? Or Russia would... I don't know. No, I feel like... What's what's the most technological... U.S. would be Terran. U.S. would be Terran. See, I want to say Japan's Protoss, but Japan's so small. And they have a few, they <laughs> yeah, but they don't armies. produce a lot, but what they have is amazing. This is true. So maybe Japan is... This is an awesome topic. You guys in the chat, please this tell us what our, you think. This can be our contest. Done. Okay. Done. Okay, how do you determine a winner? Well, you kind of have to write an explanation about it, then we can pick one. Okay, guys, the go. races are Zerg, Protoss, Terran. You know this, but what you don't know is who in the world represents those races the best. And give us your reasons. So um, where should they post this? On our Facebook they or here post, in let's chat? Let's post it on Facebook. Guys, post it on our Facebook. So it's um, www.facebook.com slash esports Canada. Good. Right. I love how you know those things because I always forget it. So Very go fun. to our Facebook page. We're going to double check for sure, but it's <laughs> facebook.com slash esports Canada. There we go. Um, there, just message us with your uh, answer. So we want to know. And this is for a Heart of the Swarm beta key. So if you guys want one or want one for your friend, uh, go ahead and write this. If you want to have two entries, go tell your friend to enter as well and come watch us. And um, we want you to tell us for each of the three races in uh, StarCraft, tell us what what race or nationality mm -hmm. best represents that that yep. race in StarCraft. Exactly. So we were joking around saying China, <laughs> China could be like Zerg. And uh, give us a good reason. Don't be racist about it because we won't choose you for the hot key. Nope. Be clever and funny and awesome about it because that's what we want in esports. And we want your participation. And um, if you just want to participate and you don't want a key, just let us know. But yep. we'd like to hear your answers and maybe some good ones. <laughs> it looks like we've already got a bunch of awesome ones in the chat. So keep it coming, guys. Oh, North America is Zerg. Keep EU is Protoss. Korea is uh, Terran. That's interesting. So try to give us an explanation too, though, because um, I want to. I want to hear your thinking, guys. I want to know. I want to know your logic. I want to know your rationale. And uh, even if you want to break it down, like if you want to say province-wise, like uh, if you want to say like, oh, the prairies are like the neutral supply depots. <laughs> They're, no, just no, no. There. they're They're just expanses of uh, stuff. Oh. Um, uh, <laughs> that was terrible. Maybe maybe Vancouver would be Protoss? Why, why do I think of them as Protoss? I can see that. I, can, I don't know. I have a yeah. feeling too. But anyways, <laughs> why, were, why were we talking about this? Okay, so during oh, Opium Wars, China, China's lost his battle. Yep. And, they were like, and they were like, oh, we want to give you, like, uh, the UK wanted to take some sort of, I guess, tributes or something like that. So China yeah. said, here, have Hong Kong. Whoa. And they gave the Portuguese. They gave them a city? They gave the Portuguese Macau. Wow! Yeah, I didn't know that. Was, and then there was like this thing where they had the contract. And it was like hundred years later after British rule, we're gonna give you, you know, back because oh, yeah, jerks. Yeah, give it back. Yeah. So so you know, hundred years later, it was nineteen ninety seven. Hong yeah. Kong was given back to China. Yeah. But then um, citizens there were really angry and didn't want to go back to China because you know. <laughs> You know, after living under virtual, things were good. Like, things weren't bad. You know, they had... Because, see, that's like Protoss to like, being like, now go to the Zerg Overmind. They're like, oh, right. no. So, like, compare, comparing to, like, yeah, yeah, at the time, exactly. The island of Hong Kong wasn't, it wasn't like it was now, right? The island of Hong Kong? Hong Kong's an island. It's a I tiny island. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> what but, planet are we talking about right now, actually? We're talking about Mars. Okay. <laughs> but Come anyways, on. what happens is, so citizens are complaining because, you know, they hear things from people coming from the mainland. And back then, it was really racist. Like, when I used to live in Canada, we used to go to Chinatown with my mom, and we used to buy groceries, right? But if you spoke Mandarin to any of the, like, Cantonese, uh, like, South, like So Mandarin owners, is Hong Kong, right? No, Mandarin is China. Sorry. 
Hong and Kong Cantonese, Cantonese yeah. is Hong Kong? Yeah. Oh. They wouldn't sell us stuff. Wow. They wouldn't talk to you. Wow. But that is racist. Yeah, it was racist. It was, yeah. I'd sell you stuff. Thanks, man. I'd sell you Italian stuff, though. I'd buy that stuff. Would you go to an Italian... I used no. to go to Italian stuff all the time. Yeah? yeah? What's your favorite meal? What's your favorite Italian meal? I want to say something like... I really like lasagna, actually. Boring. But I really like it. It is good. It's really good. Yeah. Okay, if you were on an island, you could only have one meal for the rest of your life, what would you pick? I know you're going to answer the wrong one. 